Hello! If you don't know, I'm gonna I'm gonna let you on on a little thing right here. Light language retreat is coming up so quickly. It is so juicy. It is so expansive, and it's freaking calling your name. I want to give you a couple details before we get into this legendary EFT tapping today. And the EFT tapping is all about receiving, creating, and holding that new identity. And then at the end, there is a amazing money activation transmission that you do not want to miss so make sure you stay for the whole episode to receive the highest level shift today okay but before we get into the eft tapping just a little update for the light language retreat may 20th is the last day to get pay mint plan may 31st is the last day to sign up for the retreat so if you have been literally going melissa this is it. I know it's it. I know I'm going to be there. I know I'm going to be sipping on beautiful, fresh juices and <laughs> putting my toes in the water and the pools and the beaches and having massages and going to amazing sound baths and elevating myself spiritually, mentally, physically, emotionally, and my business, of course. If you know, you know. So I would absolutely love, love, love to support you at the Light Language Retreat in Bali. And then as always, if you're like, girl, Bali is a little bit too far. I have my beautiful light language summit coming up in September. And also the light language summit is for everyone. It's not for you. If you know, well, let me, let me back up. It's not just for beautiful souls that speak light language, channel light language, quantum healing. No, it's for everyone that wants to create a beautiful dynamic shift in September. And then if you are interested in having a VIP day prior to the summit, I'm going to be opening up to beautiful souls that would like to meet in real life and do some activations and shifts for their light language. So that is going to be an option as well. Those are two beautiful ways to hang out in real time, IRL, so that we can help you expand, grow, and evolve. And then, are you ready? Are you ready to get into this tapping? I'm going to tell you, I recorded it and then I did it another time, like 30 minutes later. So it's good, y'all. I think this is one of the best tappings that I've done. I'm serious. So I hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions, feel free to send me a message, melissa at melissabbates.com or on Instagram, melissabbates underscore. Or if you're listening to this on YouTube, feel free to drop a comment in the chit chat. Make sure to hit those likes, y'all. Make sure when you are accessing any of my comment, you are liking it. You're hitting those five stars because it really helps the collective rise. It helps my work get out to more beautiful souls like yourself that are ready to anchor into a new life, new earth, new vibration. So hit the, hit the, hit the stars for someone else today. Hit the like for someone else today, not just for yourself, but hit it because you know someone else out there can benefit from this magic. And with that said, I appreciate you. I love you. I adore you. Obviously, if the Light Language Retreat or Light Language Summit is not up your alley right now, I have a plethora of services. So they're always in the show notes, always in the comments. Feel free to scroll them, see what connects with your beautiful soul. And let's get into this beautiful tapping. And so it is. So when we have these big hearts, instead of working against them, open them up. And something you could use. And let's do a little tapping. <laughs> tapping. Bell. We're just going to do it on the karate chop and the heart. So we're going to start in the karate chop. Ah, take a deep breath in. I am opening my heart today. I am so excited to live in love today. I am so excited to receive an overflow today. I open my heart today. And we're gonna do a full round, so just follow, follow along with me. I open my heart to my soul truth today. I open my heart to love today. I open my heart to receiving an overflow today. Feel that shift. I open my heart to love today. I open my heart to miracles and blessings today. I open my heart to love today. I invite myself to relax and love today. 
right on the side, I open my heart to love today. And in fact, I am worthy and deserving of love today. I am worthy and deserving of the best life today. I am worthy and deserving of the most success today. I open my heart to love today. I ground into love today. I anchor into love today. I open my world to love today. And even though I always don't feel like I deserve love, I'm deciding to change that idea today. I'm deciding to remember how amazing and fabulous I am today. I'm deciding to release all the worries and the stress and the doubt and the fear today. Because today I'm choosing a new identity. Today I am birthing my infinite truth. Today I'm excited to meet a new high vibrational reality of overflow. Because I am fucking worthy and deserving of it in every single way. I am worthy and deserving of it. And I release the resistance. I release the doubts of having more and living in an overflow. And even though I teeter taught between having it all and not having it all, today I'm making a damn high vibrational decision. I'm making a decision to have it all in overflow. I'm making a decision to live in my infinite soul truth. I'm making a decision to receive the blessings of the universe daily. Because I'm simply worthy and deserving of it. I'm simply worthy and deserving of it. And I open my heart to all of it and more today. Because I'm simply worthy and deserving of it. So it is. Take a deep breath in. Hand over your heart. Infusing it with light language. Let that breath go. Shoo mutaya kata mutaya kataya 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 we're just bringing all of that new frequency into your body shuaya mutaya kaya mutaya kataya 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 take a deep breath in hold to the top shuaya maya haya 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 Beautiful. And it's 11.44 on my end, so end of a cycle. So let me know how you're feeling in the chat. That was fun. I honestly could have kept tapping. I was like, I could tap for 30 minutes, y'all. Are we going to do this for 30 minutes? <laughs> but let me know how you're feeling after just that very simple tapping. Beautiful tapping. Thank you. I received that. Yeah. So we did a mix of the beautiful thing is that said, oh, I love that. Oh my God. <laughs> yes, that made me so happy. Um, and you can always come back to it because I'm going to save it. But the beautiful thing is with the tapping that I did today, since I speak light language, 
as I was saying the English, I was also transmuting the frequency of light. So it was encoding every single ounce of you throughout the whole process, which was so juicy. Um, and that's why when I call forward people for the Light Language Academy, I'm like, it doesn't matter if you're EFT, meditation, yoga, business, manifestation, light language and quantum healing infused for your community is a fucking game changer. It's even infusing it for myself as a game changer. I felt the back of my heart open wide. Yes. So good. Feel so much lighter. Peaceful. Thanks. Yes. Yes. That was so much fun. Yes. Oh, and that was random. I did not have that schedule today, y'all. I was like, we're going to come here. We're going to do a nervous system activation. We're going to take some beautiful questions, hang out with the crew. Um, and then we're all going to go about our way. But hey, you know what? The universe provides. And all I am is an open vessel to help my beautiful um, the souls here and watching the replay, you know, transform. So if you want to get really wild, I don't exactly know. We we got on at 11. So I want to say we probably started it around like maybe like 40 minutes in. Um, so you can always come back and scroll to the 40 minutes and just do the tapping. Um, I think it's so powerful. It'll be really powerful to do. I can try to, I can, maybe I can try to do it cut it because I'm recording it on my computer as well. So maybe I can try to cut it and put it on my podcast because I think that would be phenomenal too. So I'll try to figure that out. <sighs> my loves, I love you. I love you. I love you. I'm glad you're feeling good. I think that was just phenomenal. I have been, you know, infusing EFT tapping as well as my nervous system was on fire the past four days. So it's better. Yes, 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 yes. And you know, this is the thing. And pay attention to the mentors that you are co-creating with, even if you're just, you know, coming to lives. There are some people that will trigger your nervous system. And I started to realize that. And I was like, I have one mentor that is so, like, she's so in her divine masculine. Oh, sorry, she's so in her, well, no, I have a couple mentors. One is really in her divine masculine. One is really in her divine feminine. So when I was, you know, in that space of healing my nervous system and my divine feminine, I noticed that I wanted to listen to the other beautiful soul. And they're both money mentors. Um, but I noticed that when I would listen to her, my whole body would just, like, and I would know when I listened to her, my whole body was like, oh, I love her work. Oh my God, I swear by it. But like in that moment, your girl needed the chill. So just pay attention to what season you are in. And when you're co-creating with mentors, you know, any content online, make sure that it's supporting you because sometimes you can sit with a mentor and it, there's nothing wrong with wiling you up because I do feel you know, our code should be soul penetrating and you should walk away being able to think about something and wanting to experience something new. Right. But also just pay attention to what's going to support me in this moment. This, these solar storms. Okay. So also I have some new beautiful souls. I have about 12 minutes left for this beautiful live. So if you have any questions for your own personal journey and you would like them answered, drop them in the chat right now. I am like, hold on. Because I need. I'm also recording on my computer, and my computer is literally about to die. So <laughs> I'm like, I need to plug this bad boy in. Um. Okay. So yes, if you have any questions for your own personal journey, ask away right here, right now. Let me plug this in so I can get this up on YouTube and podcast as well. Yes, we are charging. Woo -woo. Yeah, we're charging. You're perfect. I know I'm here to help heal and shift the collective. Exactly. And I honestly, you know what, when you are ingrained in that, life just gets easier because it's not just for you. And this is a big thing. So many people get caught in their own story. Oh, my business isn't successful. Oh, my life isn't successful. And it's like, okay. So remember, let's take, let's take a step back. I am a soul here on earth. I came to grow for myself as for the collective. So right now, what path would I choose that would support both, right? And it's not like you have to focus on the collective when you're just beginning your journey. Um, but having that in your mind, especially when you're building a business, especially, this is something that I want to say, because when I first came into the industry, you know, if you launched the group program and you didn't get 10 souls or 15 souls, it was like, oh, it's not a group program. But I'm like, actually, if you have four people in your program, and that's a legendary. 
And you know why? Because there are four people that are ready to be supported by you. And that's fucking phenomenal. That, and it, it's really coming to a point, and this is something, this is something I had to do on my healing, right? Um, and it's just like, it's just being open. Like, that's why with my light language retreats, they're very intimate. They're maxed out at four people, right? So if I have a light language retreat and there's four people, boom, amazing. If I have a light language retreat and there's one person, boom, fucking amazing. It is what it is. It's, it's not a big deal. We stress over it. There's no point to stress over it. Just being in service and being in love. And, you know, if you launch the group program and you have five, 10 people, every single one of them is so unique and so genuine. And it's just holding that space for them. Right. So just food for thought. Uh, what, would be in my highest alignment for me to do to bring in that cash money. Come back to your soul truth. Your 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 soul is ready to birth this new level of you. And this is I'm gonna give this, I'm gonna say this for anyone. A lot of the people that hang around me here um are really high level quantum healers and light language facilitators. This life is your choice. If you don't desire those timelines, then it's actively making that um, connection with the universe because the universe is always going to try to bring you to them, right? So if you're, because this is what can happen. You could be working a job where you're not making enough money so that you can come into your infinite truth and know you're here to do something else. That's how a lot of things happen. If you're not desiring to go on your, soul path right now, then you can say, Hey universe, I'm not fully ready to go on my, my soul path, but I, I do desire to make a lot of money and I absolutely love what I'm doing right now. So I would really like to direct my soul money here. So start calling in your soul level money to your current career, your current, you know, job, whatever it is, start asking it because it just feels like you're kind of being squeezed in that, that, pattern to redirect you to your infinite soul truth, which can feel a little sticky sometimes when, if you're not ready to go there. And I'm not saying you're not ready to go there, but if that is the option that you're kind of in right now, um, that's what it feels like. So I would just start asking the universe and showing the universe that, you know, in this lifetime right now, this is where I would like to make my money. Right. So I know that you do, um, beautiful artworks and things of that sort. So if that's where you want to make your money, and start really claiming that timeline with the universe and doing the manifestation work for it. And it doesn't have to be obsessive, but it's really just setting this new identity. The new identity is I make so much money through this. I love sharing my work with blah, blah, blah. I love being able to do this. Make it really clear with the universe how to support you. That's that's what I would say. And that's what comes up for you personally. And I love you. What can I do to elevate daily on my journey and start speaking light language? Um, well, <laughs> you know, I'm like, start speaking light language, <laughs> just practicing, 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 you know, if you already have the, the prayer and the script for light language, it's just starting to practice, starting to practice. If you are ready to dive into a container, obviously, um, I have my Light Language Academy. There are so many beautiful light language mentors that I can also recommend to you as well. My other beautiful friend, Emily Burns, has like kind of like a startup light language collective. Um, that's kind of like the beginning of your light language just to get around it more, just to start speaking it more. So um, if you want her information, just send me a DM and I can send you hers. My light language collective, and I'm saying this is because my light language collective is like, it's the all in. It's the all in effect when you're like, Melissa, I am ready to go all in with light language, quantum healing, building my spiritual business. Sometimes we're not there energetically. You're in between it right now. So you could choose either way. Um, but there's, that's another option. If you're, if you've looked at my light language Academy and you want to see someone else's collective that feels like more supportive in maybe where you are right now, because I've had people that I've literally sent to Emily. I'm like, go hang out with Emily. And then they've come into my light language collective for the next chapter. And then I've also had people that are like, I'm going to wait, I'm going to grow, I'm going to evolve, and then I'm going to come in. So I would say when it comes to light language, 
if you feel out of sorts by yourself, hire a mentor to help you. I learned with a mentor. I didn't learn by myself. Um, after I learned with a mentor, I had another mentor and I had another mentor to help me really anchor into who I am today. So it was very beneficial. I tried. I did. I tried to read the books. I tried to watch the YouTube. I tried to do it myself because I was that person. <laughs> I am that person. I'm all about to figure it out. But there were just parts of the journey that I didn't physically understand and I required mentorship. So if you feel like you're just kind of hitting a wall or a block, I would definitely start to seek some mentorship. I also do have my light language attunement sessions. Um, so for example, if you're like, I'm not ready for the academy yet, but I just read it, I need a real big boost in my light language. I have one-to-one -one attunement sessions as well that can help support you, but it just kind of feels like you just need a guide right now to help lead you deeper on your path. And then the next thing that I'll say is I always tell anyone that wants to actively speak light language, start meditating, you know, five to 10 days, five to five to 10 days, five to 10 minutes a day for like five days and just really set the intention. I'm ready for my light language to fully come on board and that will help kind of clear any resistance out as well. Yeah. I love you. Let me know how that feels. Uh, plus you're helping everyone they connect with. Exactly. True, true. I just don't know where to start, I guess. And I need money for mentors like you. Well, one, what I would do for you is, let's see. I would also tune into Emily. She's, she's a, she's a very gentle mentor. Um, I feel like you would benefit from her. And it just feels like a, a gentler path. Her collective isn't as expansive as my academy as well on a financial investment level. Um, so she will teach you the basics of light language and how to get started. My academy is more of teaching you how to channel. How to, she teaches you how to channel too, because fun fact is I taught her. <laughs> so she's... She was one of my students. Um, she, she teaches you how to channel. I teach you how to channel. I teach you how to speak light language. I teach you how to quantum heal. I teach you how to do grid work. I teach you how to read soul blueprints. I teach you how to do business blueprints, money blueprints. I teach you how to build your business. You have access to my beautiful money portal. So my academy is kind of like the whole shebang. And her beautiful collective is more of like, I'm just getting started with light language. I want to be around it. I want to get to know it. Um, and that's why I think it's so beautiful. And this is why I always say, you know, when you come into the Light Language Academy and you feel like you want to birth some type of collective for people to grow with light language, please do it because we need more. I I know that I am not everyone's mentor and that's okay. Um, so, you know, I have other people that have just graduated the Light Language Academy that are working on building their mentorship with light language. And that brings me so much joy. Like it brings me so much joy because one, I don't want to do it all. I don't want to do it all. And also, I'm just so excited for like one, two, three years down the line. Like Australia is rocking with light language. Um, but one, two, three years down the line, you know, when people are like, oh, I'm gonna go get my tea and I'm gonna go have a light language session. Because light language is so phenomenal. Like it's so transforming, it's so healing, it's so immaculate, it's so like literally helped to birth a higher version of you. Um, and that's why. I lead this path. This is why I lead this movement to, to bring other beautiful light language souls online. So, um, yeah, I would say if this is a path that you want to take, I would definitely check out sweet Emily Burns too. She's, she's amazing. I love her. Um, how could I get better clarity on what I should be offering in my new business? Oh, I love this. So one, I offer so blueprint sessions, uh, that is it. If you want someone to support you, I would love to support you in that. And then the next way is uh, having soul talks. So taking your journal out and going, hey, soul, uh, I'm ready to expand my business. What would you like to offer? Um, I know. I know you did one of my attunement sessions already. I did. Um, so when it comes to light language, it's consistent. It's a consistent thing. So a lot of my academy clients, I have some people that come on in one month. I have some people that come on in two weeks. I have some people that come on in two months. Um, it's the consistent work. And also if there's any resistance in your life around light language, um, that could be actually holding you back from your path. So when you come into a collective or come into attunement sessions, um, 
they so the attunement session is an activation and expansion. So even if you've already started light language, we see where you are and then we'll take you to the next level. Or if you're ready to start light language, we activate you, which I already know you've had a session with me. So um, the another attunement session could just help you expand to a next your next level in that space. Um, yes. How can I get better? Yes. If you have a question, I have like two more minutes. If you have a question, drop it in. How can I get better clarity on what I should be offering in my new business? I want to give you another answer. That's why I want to read it again. So one, definitely my soul blueprint readings are amazing. I just got, I brought some beautiful, a beautiful soul clarity the other day. She was launching a program and she was just not lit up at all. And I'm like, you have a, a program that's already ready that would be so good that you would be so lit about lit up about and she was like yeah you're right so sometimes it's just a redirection so the next answer is tuning into what excites you sometimes like when i first started my business i just kind of looked around at what other people were offering and i just created my offers from that and sometimes they weren't always fun now i know what i like to do and that's what i do i know what i like to do and that's what i do so Tune in with your soul. I love I love offering light language. I love talking about money. I love doing quantum healing. So I know it's going to be something of that. I love speaking in front of beautiful audiences. I know it's going to be something like that. Really tune in to what lights you up. There's no point for us to come to earth and create a business where we're not lit up. There's no point for us to sit with clients where we're not lit up because it's not helping us. It's not helping them. You want to offer something. And this is something that I said to her as well. I'm like, you're offering this program, but you know, are you lit up about it? Um, are you, are you going to be lit up with these clients? Right. And it was just like, oh, not really. Right. So it's like, well, let's offer a program and services that we're lit up about that. We're so excited to get on the phone calls with these beautiful souls. Like yesterday when I was getting on my one-to-one -one calls, I, the energy I had was literally like, I was just so excited because I knew that they were going to have some truly amazing shifts and they did. They had some profound fucking shifts, right? So, and it's also, you know, when you offer something that you're lit up about, you have this confidence that comes through. I only want people to have the best experience with my sessions. So I really hold the space for them. And I trust that being a vessel of light and love and abundance and God's source universe of all there is. They're going to have the best sessions. Um, thank you for answering. This is very helpful for me. Yes. So yeah. Yes. My one rule is it has to be fun. There's no point. Like we have, we have so much like, okay, we're, we're living in the human experience. We're dealing with our bodies. We're dealing with spiritual upgrades. We're dealing with finding ourselves coming back to our truth. Like, come on, there has to be parts of our life where it just gets to be easy. So let business be easy. Like yesterday, if some of you watched, I did a beautiful live with Danny Lent because he just um, created a beautiful tap tap affirmation deck, which is all about EFT tapping, and it was so much fun. And I literally messaged him and I was like, "You could eat." I was like, "Thank you for the sparkly like live that we did together." You know, and I was just like playing QVC. I was like, if you would like to purchase this deck, it's $44 and you can get it. If you're out of Australia, you have to pay shipping, whatever. But it was fun. And it was just fun because, you know, sometimes when people sell things, it's like you get into this frequency that's like, I cannot offer you. I cannot tell you what I offer. I'm like, no, I have one-to-one -one calls. I have my Light Language Academy. I have my Light Language Tree. I have my Light Language Summit. What do you want? I got you. I hook you up. I have my money embodiment, right? Selling is, is a service of the soul. That's what I'm saying now. Selling is a service of the soul. So sell, sell, have fun, show people how you can help them, you know, rise, grow and evolve. I can't wait for my one-to-one -one with you. I can't either. I'll be very excited to support you. My beautiful soul. You're, I, she's a, a high vibrational light language queen. Um, and it's funny because one of my recent sessions that I had, I met this girl randomly and I just fucking loved her. And I was like, I don't know why I love you, but you're just so amazing. And then she ended up booking like a kind of like a soul blueprint healing session with me. And then I was reading her blueprints and I was like, oh, you are a master light language and channel and quantum healer. That's why I fucking liked you. So, you know, when I meet people, I don't just go tap into their soul blueprint. 
Uh, but when you book a call with me, you give me access to tap into who you are and what you're going to be. But I just knew I felt the energy. I just felt this amazing energy from her. And I just felt really connected and bonded with her. Um, so it only made sense. It only made sense that we have very unique, similar soul signatures. So a lot of times what I'll say is, you know, if you find me here, you can find me for multiple reasons. One, you can find me because it's time to elevate your abundance and you're ready to go on that pathway of ascension, or you're here to go on the pathway of activating your channel, you know, activating your light language, activating your quantum healing. And also, if you want to start channeling, um, I have another program that's called Awaken Your Divine Channel that is just about channeling. It teaches you how to channel as a high vibrational soul of light, it teaches you how to channel angels and Octarians and your star family and Sophia Christ consciousness and just beautiful divine beings of light. If that feels like your path, then I have that too. I have a lot, y'all. I have been in this business since 2020. So my business is here to serve the collective. So that's the question. Whenever I create master classes or I create programs, it's how can I serve the collective? I'm not serving myself. Y'all, I know how to channel. I know how to speak light language. I know how to quantum heal. I know it all, right? I'm serving the collective. So it's important to remember that your services are for the collective. So if you're not sharing them with the collective, then what are you doing? Share your services. You know, something that came through the other day was I was just kind of with my team chatting and it was like a lot of people don't understand that they came here to guide. They came here to wake people up. They came here to show people a new path of their soul truth. And I feel like if more mentors and guides knew that, their businesses would be so much easier because they would, it's coming back to that same notion that I was talking to earlier. We're here to serve the collective and guide the collective as we live the most amazing, abundant, juicy, delicious life, of course. So if you needed to hear that today, I want to offer you that today because it's so important for business owners to be so unapologetic about their services. We're not, you know, stuffing our services down people's throats. We're giving people the opportunity to rise, to grow, to evolve, to meet a new chapter of themselves. Like I'm so fucking grateful for every single mentor that came in front of me, for every single mentor that challenged me and challenged my wallet. Like till this day, I know that I am at a higher income bracket because of one of my mentors, because she was so unapologetic about our fucking prices. And that is why I raised my um, flow of money so much just because I had a dream of working with her, right? So that's that's something that I would say, you know, whatever price you're charging, don't feel bad about it. Whatever price you're charging is either going to invite someone to grow with their money or they're going to choose to not grow. And that's not on you. So the way that I charge, you know, my one-to-one -one services are between like $155 to $300. Um, with the one-to-one -one calls, my academy is six thousand at this point um the awaken your channel is about eight hundred dollars my money embodiment is about five hundred or a thousand i'm not sure where it is right now but it's just money it's just money and i know even saying that it's like melissa it's not just money but it is money it's just money because when we look in our quantum field and if you listen to abraham hicks you know that we have so much money that we can access every single day, right? And we're coming back. So let's do that. Let's let's have a little money activation for the beautiful souls that are here. Throw a 333 three, three in the chat if you would like a money activation today. This 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 is just getting real spicy. If you would like a money activation today, throw a 333 three, three in the chat. Let me know if you want to feel a little light language money activation just to get your flow of abundance moving and grooving. Oh, okay. Okay. I guess, I guess there are people here that like money. Okay. I'm here for it. Let's do it. So close your eyes. Obviously, if you're driving, do not close your eyes. <sighs> if you're driving, just stay awake, stay here, stay present. But if you're not driving, take a moment to close your eyes. Take a moment to come back to your heart. And I want you, I invite you to literally see yourself sitting in your heart bringing your inner child in your heart with you. I like to sit crisscross applesauce in my heart with my inner child. 
I usually put her on my lap. And I'm just gonna speak a prayer over us first. Thank you, 888, yes, let's go. Divine God, source, universe of all there is today with this beautiful collective. I invite you to shower the collective with codes of abundance and wealth and money and prosperity. I invite you to help them remember who the fuck they are on a financial level. I invite you to help them receive at a, such a high capacity today across all time and space. I just invite you to feel that prayer. Drop a one in the chat if you feel that prayer. And my God, source, universe, of all there is, I invite you to help these beautiful souls within this entire collective that we live in to purge the resistance around money, to purge the fear around money. Help them release, please, and thank you right here, right now. Beautiful, I love it, good. Divine God, source, universe, of all there is, today, the beautiful souls here and watching the replay, I invite you to help them activate a new level and chapter of their abundance across all time and space. I invite you to help them remember who the fuck they are on a financial level with ease and grace. And I invite you to help shift their timelines and help open them up to access new portals of money, new portals of wealth, new portals of prosperity, and more clarity around money. I really invite in the clarity around money. God, I invite you to help them with this source universe of all there is. And nextly, I invite you to flow a beautiful transmission through me to help the collective rise at the highest capacity around wealth, prosperity, money, and abundance. I invite you to bring such a high vibrational transmission through me today, God, source, universe, of all there is that everyone can easily access new chapters of their wealth and abundance and prosperity and money magic here. And now I will wait for this beautiful channel from you, God, source, universe, of all there is. I am ready. When you are ready. Taking a deep breath in here. Infusing every single beautiful soul here and watching the replay with the highest form of light, love, and abundance. Allowing this beautiful transmission to pop, cleanse, clear, and purify any density within their field around money right here, right now. Taking a moment to thank this beautiful transmission to elevating every single one of us here now watching the replay. And now I invite you to bring something into your mind's eye. Maybe it's a number that you would love to receive this week. Bring that amount of money into your conscious mind. So you could say, so earlier we did an example of $5,000. So you could say, dear divine conscious of conscious mind. This week, I fully call in $5,000 and always something better to receive, hold, and have. Now, whatever number you're calling in, I first want you to see it in your crown chakra. Drop that number in your crown chakra. And now drop it in your third eye. Drop it in your throat chakra. Drop it in your heart. Drop it in your solar plex. Drop it in your sacral. Drop it in your root chakra. And drop it in your womb space, which is just your leg, your legs. From, from with women, our womb space goes from our hips all the way down to our feet. For men, the womb space goes just kind of more hip area. And now we're just going to take some five deep breaths into that number. 
we're just going to bring some safety around it for our nervous system. So whatever number it is, for example, I am now safe to receive $5,000 this week. That's what you're going to say. I am now safe to receive $5,000 this week. Take another deep breath in. Let it out. I am now safe to receive $5,000 this week. And pay attention to your tone because you might want to slow down. Take another deep breath in. Let it out. I am now safe to receive $5,000 this week. Because you're, you're getting your nervous system ready to receive it. Take another deep breath in. Let it go. I am now safe to receive $5,000 this week. And I'll let, take the last breath and hold it at the top. Let it go. I am now safe to receive $5,000. It's beautiful. Just grounding an anchor against that. Inviting God, source, universe of all there is to clear away any resistance that these beautiful souls here and watching the replay are starting to feel. Purify, cleanse, clear. Thank you. Across all time and space. And you might start to feel like, I actually want to call in more money. So maybe you're like, I am now safe to receive $10,000 this week. Maybe $5,000 feels too small for you. Go to that next level. So for examples, if anyone shifted to 10,000, I am now safe to receive $10,000 this week. Maybe something is going, oh, I am now safe to receive $20,000 this week. Because what you're doing, we're, we're, we have this frequency around you that's helping you regulate your nervous system to feel safer with money. When you co-create with the frequency of money and abundance and wealth and prosperity, it helps your whole being feel more safe to actually open up to receive it. So that's why you might be going, oh my God, I actually feel like I can receive more this week. Beautiful. Hello, my loves. Welcome. We're just doing a little money activation. How are we feeling? What came up for you with that? Come back, open your eyes. How are you feeling with that, loves? And it's so important to regulate the nervous system with money because if you don't feel safe to receive, then you're just holding yourself away from it. If you don't feel safe to have the job you desire, if you don't feel safe to call the love, if you don't feel safe to hold, you know, a hundred thousand dollars in your bank account, if you don't feel safe to create the successful business, taking time to regulate your nervous system is profound. And if you are desiring a nervous system regulation by one to one. Light language spinal sessions are all about nervous system regulation and expansion. And then if you want to get deeper connected to money and nervous system, my money embodiment program is great for the nervous system with money. I would buy a lot of tickets. Oh, yes, we love this. Excitement around receiving it, even though I have no idea where it will come. And we don't need to know. That is one thing you don't need to know. I always say I ex I receive money in expected and unexpected ways. because. God knows. God knows. Universe knows. I don't need to know. I don't need to rack my brain, right? I don't need to rack my brain at all. It's just coming back to trust. Just bringing this vibration of trust. And opening up your conscious mind, subconscious mind to receiving in expected and unexpected ways and believing that it's possible. You're so welcome, my loves. Take one more deep breath in. Shoo! Placing your hand over your heart. Shoo! Yeah, 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 yeah. Shoo! Yeah, 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 yeah. Shoo! Oh, okay. Let's see. Oh, I think we're good. I think we're complete. I think we're complete, my love. So, yes, if you're feeling called to do any expansion, if you feel like you need your own personal expansion, 
and you're not quite sure to start where to start, just send me a DM and I can guide you to what uh, program or service would be beneficial for you to attack and hang out in. Um, I also offer, they're not on my website yet, but I also offer um, combo oil sprays as well as oils which are here to support your every single day. Um, when you buy them, they're coded to your own essence. So if you want to work a lot on abundance and money, I'll code the spray and the oil for abundance and money. And how you do it is you use it every single day. You spray it on you. And every time you spray it, um, it helps raise your vibration around money and abundance. And just like what you experience today in this live, that is exactly what the spray and the oil does. So if you're interested in that spray, just to support you daily, even if you're not working on money, say you're working on your soul growth, or you're working on light language, we can code it for that as well. But obviously, because I'm an abundance queen, I'm still going to code the spray with abundance because everyone deserves more abundance. But we can put that extra layer on as well. So if you're interested in that, it's not on my website. Just send me a DM. The price for the combo is 11.11. That's the price for the combo, and I can send you the link to buy the spray. And I use I custom make sprays for myself. My whenever people come to the Light Language Retreat, they always get custom sprays as well, and they're really helpful because sometimes we live obviously we live in the collective, and just having that boost of like raising your vibration or putting the oil on, it's been really beneficial in my journey. And I started using sprays and oils probably two three years ago. Um, and they're just a game changer. Like when I was in Bali, if, if any of you have been to Bali before, you know, Bali is a beast in its own. Bali will bring you so many upgrades, but it's so important to stabilize yourself and ground. There was a point when I was in Bali that I physically had to go buy an oil because I was so ungrounded. So I just, I still have the oil with me that I still use, but I just put it on and I instantly felt grounded. I instantly felt more peaceful. So what I did is I took the oil and I coated it myself, of course. Um, so the oils supporting me with abundance and wealth and prosperity and grounding and helping me access a new, higher, uh, multidimensional version of myself. Bali is so magical. Yes, also, if you do want to join me in the Light Language Retreat, in Bali. The last day to sign up for the payment plan is May 20th. So that is in about five days. And the last day to sign up for the pay in full is May 31st. So I'm excited for the beautiful souls that will be in Bali. And you'll all be getting your own personal sprays as well if you're coming to the retreat. Um, and that's it. I love you. If you have any questions after this is over, just feel free to DM me. If you're ever like, oh my God, Melissa, I listened to your live and now something's clicking and I have a question, feel free to just send me a message. I love you. I adore you. It's literally 12, 22 on my end in California. Have a beautiful day. If you, I'm going to say, when you receive some money magic or money expansion or your mind just opens up to a new access of money, send me a DM. Let's celebrate together. Uh, this was so, such a generous, uh, generous session. Oh. I am so happy. Honestly, it's fun for me. <laughs> I always say this, y'all, like, you know, if I didn't have a collective or a community to co-create with, that would be really sad for me. If I didn't have clients, that would be really sad for me because I would have nowhere to offer my soul gifts. So you coming to the live, hanging out with me, watching the replay, commenting, liking my posts, like it is so soul gratifying because I know that there are people out there receiving and growing and evolving just by me existing. And for a soul led entrepreneur, like it doesn't get better than that. So just as you're saying, you're gener generous. I appreciate you for taking the time to grow because a lot of people, you know, 80% of the collective is not doing this. They, they're not. So for you to be here, it shows who you are. It shows how dedicated you are to your growth. And that's fucking phenomenal. So just as, you know, thank you for spending time with me. Thank you for trusting me. Thank you for receiving the blessings of the universe and God's source today. And I'll just end this beautiful, you know, session with a prayer. And I just say, God, source universe of all there is, I fully invite you to bless the whole entire collective with so many miracles, 
God, I invite you to bless the collective in ways that they are manifesting, in ways that are they're trying to grow. I invite you to bless them in expected and unexpected ways. I invite you to infuse the collective today with more magic than you've ever infused the collective, with more light, with more love, with more abundance, God. I believe by simply asking you, you're already doing. It gets to be that simple, my loves. I pray for the collective. I Even when I see people on the side of the road, and I invite you to pray for the collective too. <laughs> They're like, ask them, pray for the collective. Don't just pray for yourself, pray for the collective. You know, it's important to know that if we have a million people out here elevating their abundance, and we do, obviously. We have a million people out here elevating their abundance, tapping into their soul growth. That makes it easier for the collective. If we have 5 million people out here elevating their abundance, tapping into their soul growth, it makes it easier for the collective, right? So then the collective isn't waking up all groggy and just annoyed and frustrated. No, we're waking up with excitement. I live in my own grids. I create my own grids and I teach my Light Language Academy <clears throat> and channels to live in your own grid because you can do that. Uh, but whenever I did live in the corrective grid, it was rough and tough. It was fucking rough and tough. Ever since I was a kid, if I see an accident on the road, I send a little, I do too. I always say, I'm like, soul signature, y'all. I'm like, I see them. I'm like, many blessings to you. Many blessings to you. Many blessings to you. Many blessings. blessings. Because it's just nice. It doesn't matter. Like taking a second out to bless someone else, it does not ever, like it's it's nothing. But at the same time, it's everything, right? So, you know, having this beautiful hour expansion, hour and a half expansion with you, it was so fun for my soul. And I know it's everything to every one of you that watch it and, and receive it. And you get to live a higher vibrational day today. And like, I know that I don't take this as much as I could. And I should, but it brings me great gratitude to know that I am helping people live a better life, right? So beautiful. I love all of you. And all, I know if you listen to my podcast, I know I always say this. This is the last thing I'm going to say. <laughs> I was listening to someone the other day and they were talking about love and it connected to me so deeply because when I'm out and about, even if I just meet someone, I'm like, Oh my God, I love you. And I know it might be, it might feel weird to people, right? How do you love me? You don't even know me, but I'm like, I love you because you're a beautiful soul on this earth and you deserve everything. And we're doing earth together. So I love you. Right. Literally. That's who I am. I am just a bundle of love. And I remember there was one point where I was going on my, my ascension with love. I had this question and I was like, can I really just walk around in this much love? Is this okay? Are people going to think I'm weird? I had these questions, these crazy false illusion questions. But in all reality, this is who I am. I'm here to be a bundle of love. So I am going to give love wherever I can. And if someone doesn't receive it, that's not on me. Right? Because I love people and I love when people make my day easier. Like something happened the other day and it was just so nice. I was out and about. It was, it, it benefited me. So I said, Oh my God, thank you. I love you so much. Thank you. I love you. Oh, I was at target and I could tell the guy was like, this, this chick is wild. She's crazy. But I was like, thank you. I love you. Have the best day ever. Have the best month ever. I was like, I'm just going to be me, right? Um, I love that you're here to be loved, right? We're, we're all here to be loved. We, and, and when we can find that essence inside of us, and sometimes it's really hard to find. Um, but when we find it, hold on to it and never judge yourself for speaking your truth, holding that vibration. Because I remember those days when I was just having a shitty day and I was walking the streets and one person smiled at me and I was like, it lit my whole freaking life up. We need more of that in the world. More smiles, more laughter, more giggles, more interaction. Even if it's just for five seconds or a minute, five minutes, whatever it is. Like 
we're all beautiful souls here trying to achieve something on a soul level and on a human level. And it's just really respecting that with so much grace and honoring people where they are. And, you know, earlier when we were talking about losing your job and losing <clears throat> parts of your life that are releasing, it's even loving on that. Like, I love you, I release you. Old partners, I love you, I release you, right? <sighs> I love you. And that's the last thing I'm going to say. Okay, so I'm going to save this if you want to come back. It will be on YouTube and my podcast um, at some certain point this week. Um, I will be back on Friday at a certain time. <laughs> I'll be back on Friday for Wake Up With Light Language. So if you are available, just if you're on my email list, just pay attention. If you're not on my email list and you want to be on my email list, send me your email. And if you, because sometimes I'll give my email list discounts without giving my other of the collective discounts. So I do add some discounts to my email as well, just for being there and hanging out with me and receiving all the magic that I channel through. <laughs> and um, what else did I want to say? Yes, if I can support you in any way, feel free to check the, big, the bio link and let me support you. Um, there's one more thing that I wanted to say. I'm like, spirit, remind me. Oh, thank you. Okay, last thing. Um, for those of you that feel really exhausted and tired right now, a lot of us are going through these freaking crazy, phenomenal light language upgrades. So just be bear with yourself, patient, take time to meditate, get out with mother earth. The other day I literally just went and laid on the grass in the park, take time for yourself, nourish yourself. It will pass. Okay. So I love you. I will be back on Friday for wake up with light language. And last thing, how are we feeling in the chat? How are we feeling? It's obviously it's 12 afternoon for me. Let me know how you're feeling in the chat. Let me know. Let me know. I want to see it. I want to see. I want you to claim this new feeling. I want you to claim this new vibration. I want you to claim it. How are you feeling? Let it, let it go. Let it go. How are you feeling? Let's see it. Okay. The hearts, the hearts are telling me you're feeling good. You're feeling good. Feeling good. Okay, good. Feeling good. And then continuously claim that. Come back to that. Stoked. Ah, oh, yes. I love that. Like the other day, I I know. I told you. See, I told you. I was going to say last thing. And now I'm over here. Last thing. I I meditated the other day and I got into such the juiciest meditation frequency that now I can tap back into it. Right? So pay attention. When you get into a juicy frequency, you can always tap it back into it. Ask your body to remember it. So ask your body to remember how you're feeling right now. So maybe in two, three days, you're like, oh, let me tap back into that beautiful feeling that I had in the life. Our bodies are geniuses. Our minds are geniuses, right? Um, South Africa, I feel like my day just started. Oh, okay. Well, that's beautiful. So you actually did wake up with light language. Oh, but it's PM. Just kidding. <laughs> well, you'll sleep well. <laughs> Oh, uh, feeling good, tired, but upgrading, amazing, confident. I oh, I love. Please, y'all, send me. I don't. I know some of you. Some of you, I'm familiar with your names. If I have not met you before, please send me a DM and introduce yourself. Tell me what you do. Tell me your business. Tell me your career. I want to know you because I love. I I used to do lives all the time when I first started my business. So. People would be like, oh, Melissa, it's me. I'm like, I know, I know your profile picture. I know who you are, honey. I know. So if we if you haven't, if we haven't had any like direct connection yet, send me a DM. Let me know who you are. Let me know where you live. Um, because I want to get to know more of you. Okay. All right. I love you. And now I will leave. <laughs> Bye, my loves. Have a beautiful day. I love you. I love you. I love you. Show you so it is.